So we are less than four weeks out. Less than four weeks? Crap. We're moving into somewhere very, very cool. I think you'll like it. So this is my new street. This is where I'll be living. I've got mum with me. Hi. This is mum. Hello. Hello. How long has it been since you've been to Melbourne? 84? Uh, 84, yes. 84. 84. Look at this. So artsy. So cool. And yeah, so tomorrow we're checking out some warehouses. Some movie. Motor feels down here. It's going to be happy. Pretty nervous. It's a big move. Ooh, baby. Uh, but it's going to be sick. It's sick. It's awesome. What, what can I say? I don't think there's no point in checking out the other place. I'm just, just going to sign off on this. this. So uh, yeah, so that's well, that's our that's our big day done, eh? <laughs> yeah, that's our we just came we just came here and <laughs> done in half an hour. Something we're so stressed about. I know. I was wigging out. I just had a phone call and I'm approved. I got the place. I can't believe it. It's just like that. That was that one's the one. I knew that was the one. As soon as I walked in there, I just had mad goosebumps. Like just just it's brand new. It's brand new. I can't believe it. Tenth of the first, locked in, baby. Lock and load. Woo! So it's the last time I'm making a video here and it's been pretty daunting to organise this next move because I'm leaving Sydney. I'm leaving Sydney for good. I've never moved into state before and I've sort of just been rolling, just going with it. Not really know what I'm doing, but I'm just doing it. And everything seems to be lining up okay, working out pretty well, which I'm happy about. Am I going to miss this place? Not really. Not knowing what I have in store, what I have planned, which you guys will see very soon. But I will miss the people, 100%. I'll miss everybody that I've ridden with, I'll miss everybody that I've worked with over the years, not just music, but also video and photos and all the guys I ride with. There's, there's a whole, you know, family's here. The whole family's here. But this move had to happen, and I'm happy about it. I need to get packing right now. Alright, let's do it. Now it's the helmets that sort of suck because I've thrown most of the boxes out. Lenses and everything, I think I'm just going to chuck them all in my bag. We all sweet there. I've already sort of packed all this down. This is where I have my bags and then all my jackets and stuff are all there. Packed up, majority anyway, just a little bit of things just floating around. Sold my WR450, that's out of here, thank goodness. That's just one thing less that I need to take. Oh, man, I'm so tired. I'm just wrecked, eh? Had a late gig last night. Now I'm just gonna pump up our air mattresses. Yeah, so okay. we've got our camping air beds, little air mattresses. So I'll pump those bad boys up and that's gonna be our bedding for the next two nights because I got rid of our bed. So the truck is delayed. But the good thing is, is that they're going to be bringing the truck over to us now, which is awesome. And then Nick's going to come and then we're going to start literally loading all this stuff up. It's going to be crazy. Interstate travel. Um, hmm, I don't think I'll do it again. I think I'm just going to stay in Melbourne this time. Then we're moving. I'm done. I'm done. Nick's here. Jinkry. Nick's here to save the day. But the most important thing in first, oh, this is the truck by the way. It's a little bit smaller <laughs> than we are first anticipated. So we've got to fit the whole house into that. So yeah, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Sweat the balls ready. Update on the truck sitch. Mad hydraulic leak. So the lift won't go up. It's stuck down. <sighs> Welcome to Avengers <laughs> It's just standard, hey. This is all we've done. This is it. And now it's going to take around an hour and a half for him to come, which means two, three, four, five hours. And then they're gonna to try to fix it, which we don't know if they can yet, so we're not even sure if we should on, keep on loading the truck up with stuff. Yeah. <laughs> and it's already, what's the time? Half past one. We've loaded four things in, man. Ridiculous, I don't know. We'll get through it, brother. We always do. How's it going, boys? Look at that. <laughs> so we fully thought, well, what well, still might have to happen, but <laughs> riding the bike down because it wouldn't fit. But we're going to try to make it fit. There's still a little bit more to go, but we're getting there. Nico is a Russian stacking lord. Can you do the Russian dance? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Done. Everything is in there. Check out the bike, man. Like, are you serious? <laughs> what the hell? Master packing by Nico. 
Good effort by all lads. Thank you. Thank, thank you, darling. Yes, lad. You got my laddie. The boys are on. It was so sick. Time to have, bloody have a decent beer and park this thing. We're out of here. This is it. Crazy. This is crazy, 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 crazy times. Do you want to see my room with nothing in it? <laughs> this is it. It's where my, it's where the picture was. Helmets, helmets. And uh, that was my working station right there. Nuts, eh? Crazy. Here we go. Big road trip all the way to Melbourne. Let's go, Amelia. Come on. Come on. Come on. Bring a little bag. She's gonna have this. Mina's just getting a little bit of sleepy poos. Alrighty, so here we are. We're in the truck. We just did our first little leg. It was um, it's funny. What's Amelia doing? She's like, back here somewhere. What are you doing? Uh oh, she wants to come out. No, oh crap, stay there. There's this horrible whistling noise through the whole thing. It's just... The entire way. So I got Ramita's noise cancelling headphones. That should solve that. And um, yeah, feeling good. Feeling tired though, actually. We only got like two and a half hours sleep after that massive day yesterday. But we got like, yeah, we still got a fever to go. So we're gonna kick it. It was really hard to grasp that I'm literally done, like I'm leaving. That's it. No more Sydney for me. I'm not going back. It was surreal. And that my whole life is literally packed in the truck right behind me. Everything, everything I own. Actually, there's one more thing coming. It's way too big to fit in here. I'm keen to show you guys pretty soon. That'll be coming in a couple of months time. Anyway, this is it. I'm bringing my life to another state, another city to start something new. It's a, yeah, it's very surreal. It doesn't it doesn't feel like it's sunk in yet. From here, I'm going straight to the warehouse. I'm gonna meet up with my agent. He's gonna hand over the keys, give me the run through, park the truck in there, and then we'll leave the truck there overnight. We'll just go back to her, back, back home, back to her apartment. I'll go for a walk on the beach and have some beers. Oh, we made it. You! Um, it is boiling hot in here. Gotta we'll sort that situation out. Holy moly. I mean, everyone knows I'm a sweater. <laughs> Cool sweater. But we're here. I'm gonna give you a tour very soon. First, um, we're gonna go home because we're tired <laughs> and the cat's freaking out. Look at the poor thing. Yeah. She's hating life. She hates it. So we're gonna get all of us. We're just gonna sort ourselves out and have a good sleep. Come back tomorrow, do a bit of a clean up because it's a bit dusty. Unload baby and set up. But we're here. We made it. Nine hours of driving, nine hours of power after three hours sleep. <laughs>